all gigafactories compared side by side. I'm Brian. Welcome to my Tesla weekend. Well, normally I do these over on Lars's channel at Best in Tesla, but due to a scheduling conflict, we weren't able to get it to him uh, before he went out for his ski trip. So I'm going to just put it up on this channel. And on that channel, I normally go 60 to 90 seconds to keep it brief. We've got a little more time, but I'll still keep it nice and short. In Shanghai, the biggest news is cars are shipping out in huge numbers at that. In the southwest corner, the uh, building is moving along, not as quickly as you'd expect, typically. In the northwest corner, they're really tearing stuff up, and it's starting to look like they're actually putting in a lot more building up there. Partway down, um, also on the west side, there's even more construction. Yeah, this factory is still getting bigger. So, a lot going on in Shanghai. In Berlin, one thing to look at is the main entrance is coming along. That's great. The employee parking is developing nicely. Not super fast, but well. The battery building is almost fully framed. That's kind of a big deal, but it's still going to be a while before we see equipment going in, which is why Berlin will be starting with 2170s instead of 4680s. The wastewater treatment building is almost covered, almost framed, ready to get walls and a roof put on. So that's great. And the big news there is there are so many Model Ys sitting in the lot, I don't know, for testing. It's apparent that they're not supposed to sell those cars, but maybe that just means in Germany. Maybe they can sell them outside the EU. Seems like kind of a lot to never sell, if you ask me. There's also great work going on in Texas. Way more concrete in the south, where I think the loading and logistics lot is going to be. The cyber wall has got a lot more mm, work done. Dirt dug out, the road is widened, it's almost ready for pavement. They're going to do uh, great stuff there to make trucks have an easier time getting around it. The employee parking lot has seen a lot of grading going on. They're going to be, I guess, paving this soon? Something's going on there, and I'm excited to find out what. Maybe it's the addition of more superchargers, which we did see show up on site this week. Of course, the roof has a significant expansion in the number of solar panels, with clearly more to come. And the big news to me is in the far northeast of the site, they're back to work grading and filling and leveling. So something's going on up there, and I am awfully excited to find out what. So, what's your biggest excitement on the week? And this installment will be back next week on Lars's channel at Best in Tesla. Be nice. And of course, uh, all my Patreons always get early access to this. Either way, because it's fun and I love doing it. It's just too much work to go back to the 11, 12, 15 minute version. So what did I miss or misunderstand? Leave me all your thoughts, your wisdom, your blind and brilliance in the comments below. And a huge gigatexasized thank you to my Patreons as usual, who get early access, bonus content, an ad-free experience, and help keep the channel running for as little as a single smack of rhubarb in any given month. Thank you guys for your choice to support me. So stay tuned, stay juicy, and I simply cannot wait to hear from you clever robots on the other side of the checkered flag.